What's up everyone and welcome back to The Quarry. I would like to thank you all for tuning in today and with that being said, let's jump right into this. This would be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. Yeah, they can get kind of obnoxious, huh? Yeah. <laughs> They always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. Which way should we go? Why don't you choose? Okay, so in this one, it looks like we're playing as Nick. We've played as Abby before. So what we got here? We got Shady Glade or Rocky Road. Okay. Let's go with Rocky Roads. Good choice. Better sticks this way. Better sticks? Yeah. They're like burning or whatever. <laughs> Think we've got enough? Uh, not yet. You got three pieces of wood, and you think that's enough. So I hope this is not copyright music, because I did put on streamer mode, but I heard it doesn't work as it should. Are you sure this is safe? What, are you scared? No. Are you? No. Wait, well, hold up. No, we are not going that way. We're not gonna risk anyone dying. Okay? Or getting injured. No one needs to get crushed by a rock here, you know? The hangman. The hangman. To be the hangman is to surrender, and by doing so, gain a new perspective. So look carefully and consider that sometimes one needs to be strung up in order to let go. All right, let's keep walking. So you ever think about what's next? Like. After we die? It's heavy, man. No, I mean like, the future. Yeah, sometimes. All the time. It's so overwhelming. I know what you mean. Sometimes I just try to like, let it happen, you know? What? Like, whatever happens is what was meant to happen. Like it's all predetermined. Pedantic. I wouldn't call it that exactly. Uncertain. I'm not sure we are supposed to know. Yeah, I think uncertain. That's what I would have gone with. I don't know. I'm not sure we're supposed to know. Yeah. Fate just seems so convenient. How so? Because if it's all predetermined and you do something terrible, then you have the excuse of saying, well, it wasn't really me because everything's been pre-planned and then I'm not really in control of my actions, am I? I never really thought about it like that before. I mean, well, it's, it's totally okay if you believe that. Yeah, no, totally. Yeah. <laughs> she does got a point. I haven't even thought of it like that as well, to be honest. I don't know if we should go explore. You know what? No. Why? 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 Alright, so let's head down here. It doesn't look like we got anything else up there. 
This looks like a nice place though. Nice chill out place. Having a little walk here with Abigail. <laughs> Sincere, you're really good. Playful, do me. Uh, why are you trying to disturb her for, yeah? She is really good. Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, no, this is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah. I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course. I just... don't know what. You'll figure it out. Did you hear that? Hmm? It's probably nothing. No, listen. There's something there. <laughs> oh, look! It's so tiny. <laughs> My god, he's so... Yeah, um, you might want to get away because the mom's probably here. Save Abby. Go. <laughs> Don't breathe. You're in danger. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting then which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry causing serious consequences. Hold. Release when it's safe. Wow. That's actually really cool. That will be intense when it comes to a serious situation. Okay, I'm liking this. <laughs> oh, this slime! Oh. Annoyed. That thing almost killed me. Ah, come on, bro. Playful. Did you draw that? Okay. Did you get all that? Huh? I thought you were going to draw me getting French by a wild pig. Ah, oh, got it all up here. <laughs> <laughs> we 100% failed that, though. So we better get ready for the next one because uh, someone will die. I'm wondering if when you actually play, if it will actually tell you if you need to hold your breath. 
Because if they don't, that'll be terrible. Hackett's Quarry Camp Fire Pit. Finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick. Oh, nice. Okay. Got ourselves a little sunset going on here. Got our phone out. Take a photograph. Maybe the sunset. Or should we just get this? Yeah, let's do that. Okay, cool. So now we'll switch to Caitlin. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Whoa, now, back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh... What's going on here? Everything ready? Still no service. Ah, yeah. So, pretty boring. I wonder, maybe a satellite fell out of the sky or something? Yeah, and landed in the forest, waking from her slumber, the hag uh, hacking. Okay. You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick! Just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. No, oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. Playful. The hog of Hackett's quarry? Serious. You both okay? Ah, uh, calm down, Caitlin. Calm down. Oh my gosh, it can't be. The hog of Hackett's quarry? What? I thought you hated that phrase. <laughs> big jokes take big sacrifices. You're so brave. Oh, I just want to shrink you down to little pocket people and put you in my pocket and peep it to when I need a little pick-me-up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Special delivery! Ryan thinks you're making fun of him. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell did that gun come dude, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh... Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, and... We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop! I didn't even know you could still find these anyway. Oh, hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Stern. Not leaving you with a gun. Mocking. Not a great idea. I am not leaving Jacob with a gun. Just take it. 
Okay, there is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Oh, come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look, you and me, old-fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. No, Caitlin. All right. Yeah. Guess oh. we're gonna have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but... If I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, okay, oh, guys, so let's hope Jacob don't shoot anybody by mistake. All right, guys, that'll be it for today. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a like. Consider subscribing. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.